What's up? Uh, this is the 110th annual dinner of the Explorers Club, the longest running event at the Waldorf Astoria in history. It's kind of the epitome, the high point of celebrating uh, exploration. Friends here, we, uh, looks like we have some uh, delicious alligators and some options you can only get here at the Waldorf. My name is Ken Kamler, and what I love about this club is that everyone has at least one interesting story to tell. It, it's not typical of the Explorers Club. We're at Explorers, we're all over the world in expeditions. This is just the opposite of what we do with all ties and all sorts of things. Hi, this is Richard Muriot. I've been a club member since 1998, and I joined to further my connections to help open civilian spaceflight. My name is Katie Losey Battle. I am here at my first Explorers Club annual dinner, and I am about to avoid the goat's penis. I've heard it's very chewy. That's what that guy said, but I'm going to go for this critter, which I'm not sure what it is, but I'm very nervous. My heart is pounding. This is a night not to dream about, but to experience the new 21st century golden age of exploration fueled by technology. Welcome to the Explorers Club, the world center of exploration. It is always a pleasure for me to be here in the Waldorf Astoria at the greatest exploration display of people with vim and vigor who want to go somewhere where no one's been before. I always wanted to be a, a space explorer and I can say that um, definitely my cup has run it over. It wasn't so much that I wanted to be out there as that I had to be. All of the uh, members of the Explorers Club, you're all pioneers and it's an honor to stand here today and accept this award on behalf of the whole team. Last Saturday, only a week ago, about 10 of us, sitting mostly at table 15, found ourselves in the Sea of Cortez, carrying the flag of this club proudly on a 20-foot dinghy. I truly believe that commercial human spaceflight is the key to the future of the exploration of space and indeed to the survival of our species. Uh, hopefully one day we'll be taking many of the people in this room to, to orbit and beyond. Thank you. Our destination is the stars. We live in a world that's racked by social, political, economic strife and the, the value of exploration is that it binds us together, right? Whether that exploration is to the depths of the ocean or to the farthest reaches of the cosmos or to unravel human DNA or to understand the unified theory, whatever, all of those journeys, those explorations, what they do is allow us to imagine and sometimes accomplish the impossible. And that allows us to reveal a reality that transcends everything that divides us. Two, three, love you! Yeah! Yeah!